Hi there, hey there, hello there guys, it is Kimber, welcome back to my journey, long time, no see, well you saw me yesterday but I didn't look put together at all, <laughs> and anyway, but we are out and about, gonna go do some grocery shopping, I need to stock up on my keto foods again, I depleted everything in my house pretty much, um, so I need to go ahead and get everything, we just got gas for $1.41 a gallon, crazy, unheard of. As soon as the country's back up and running, though, you know, we'll be back up $3 a gallon. So we filled our car up for $15. I was like, that is amazing. But anyway, I thought that I would go ahead and take you guys along with me for a full day of eating. Um, yeah, that's my plan. But uh, just a quick update. After one day of eating back on keto, I dropped five pounds. It's so crazy. I know it was all water weight and stuff and inflammation, but... I'm telling you, keto is just amazing. I don't, I don't know why people do it. And the food's never as good as you want it to be if you cheat. So, tonight I plan on having a huge green salad. I have not had one of my signature salads in forever with the cucumber and the avocado. Uh, hopefully I can find a good avocado that's fresh. And I'm excited. <laughs> I really, really want it. So, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and hop off here. The hubby just brought me a Pepsi Zero. And I'm going to drink it. And I will see you guys in a bit. It's all right. All right, Ted. I got a Pepsi Zero. See? Yeah. Okay, bye. I just want to show you this real quick. He got me this too and didn't show me. But the Duke's original recipe, shorty smoked sausages. I love those things. And then it has cheddar cheese crisps. And this was at the gas station. One carb, 140 calories, 12 fat. That's good. Non-protein. So, yeah, no nitrates. Huh. Pretty cool. So, that's at your gas station. So, guys, you always... Convenience stores of Speedway. Convenience stores of... Speedway. So you always have a choice. Yay for hubby. Applause, applause. I can't clap because, yeah, I'm holding. <laughs> there you go. Okay, guys, I'm going to go ahead and snack on this for a bit. Just because I had to take some medicine earlier and I don't want my stomach to be upset. And we're going on a road trip, apparently. Yes. Well, not a road trip. We're just going to go try to find something that we're not sure where it is. So, anyway, sorry I kept it on this for so long, but I'll talk to you guys in a bit. <laughs> Continue for four okay guys thought i'll show you what i'm gonna be having for to eat right now um it is a mcdouble from mcdonald's with no ketchup no bun so it's just the pickles and a little bit of onions mustard cheese and two patties i believe there should be two patties uh, there he is. yep so i got a few of these well i actually got three of them don't know if I'm going to eat them all, but I'm at least going to eat three. These are really, really small. Like, really, really small. But that's all right. I'm going to eat those while we're out and about. Avoiding temptation. Because, oh my God, did I see something from Arby's that I really, 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 really wanted. But didn't do it. So, good for me. But I'm going to go ahead and eat this. And I'll check with you guys a bit later. Bye. I'll show you guys. Don't mind my recliner. This is a cheap recliner I've had forever. It's supposed to be in pure leather, but it's not. Yeah. Anyway, it's peeling off. Uh, we're getting a new one because we're moving. But I thought I'd show you guys my new find that I found today. Artisanal fried pork rinds, fine herbs, and vinaigrette. Zero carbs. These were at Walmart. And they have a whole section now just devoted to pork rinds. And what was that other one I got in there? He's checking. I got another one. They had like four different kinds. They had a barbecue chipotle. This is smoky black pepper and sea salt. Yeah, smoky black pepper and sea salt. They had that one. I got this one. But, uh, oops. My apologies. It has 4.5 fat and it has zero carbs. So, yeah. Really looking forward to this. Some of the ingredients here may not be the best, but it's like way down on there. I do see maltodextrin, but it's like there's no carbs. So, I know it's probably just enough to where they don't have to mention it. So, it's not going to be a clean keto, but like I said, just coming back and I really did not want regular pork rinds. So, I am looking forward to eating these and I'll tell you guys what I thought about them in a bit. I'm going to have me a serving. Okay, laters. Hey, hey guys, checking in with my dinner. I'm so excited to eat this dinner. I've been missing this. I have a chicken breast that I have done in the air fryer. Sorry for the shakiness. What I did, I went through and I cut slits into the chicken before I put it in the air fryer so the seasonings would melt into it. Oh, perfection. And then this, I'm so excited. 
This is one of my huge green salads. I did throw in six of the Tommy Toes. I cut those in half and threw in, but it's just the organic spring mix. One avocado, half of a cucumber with olive oil and some pink Himalayan seasoning. So <laughs> this is going to be my dinner and I'm so excited, guys. It feels great to be back on keto. You have no idea. I'm so happy. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and stop this and end this for the day. Well, hey guys, we just finished our live stream and church thing and it started pouring the rain so that was not a good thing but it is over now we're kind of having a debate as far as oh, what we want to eat i was thinking about doing a salad from subway but guys it's like ten dollars to get a, a salad from subway and i don't i don't understand that and i was thinking maybe i can get me some wings from pizza hut because they have like the cajun rub which i like to try so I'm not really sure <laughs> exactly what I'm going to be doing, but I'll definitely let you guys know when I do it. And tell me below, would you prefer salad or wings? Maybe both? Who knows? I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, guys. So I did go with wings, and I love the garlic parmesan ones. But they're 140 calories for one wing, which is a little outrageous, and I did get 12. That's like 17, almost 1,700 calories if I were to eat them all. So instead, I went for a dry rub, and this is a Cajun dry rub, and it is so good. So, so good. So I'm going to go ahead and eat these, and I will see you guys in a bit. Oh, they're so good. Okay, guys, checking in. Last meal for the day. I had the wings earlier. This is a huge salad again with an avocado, a cucumber, and six tummy toes, or whatever you call them, grape tomatoes, with lots of olive oil and pink Himalayan seasoning with garlic and pepper. And then I have a New York strip done with sea salt, pepper, and the same pink Himalayan salt on top. That's going to do it for me today, guys. Wonderful day of eating. So I will see you guys later. Take care. Bye. Ta. Well, hi there. Hey there. Hello there, guys. It is Kemper. Welcome back to my journey. Thought that I'd go ahead and show you my quick first meal for the day. I have two ounces of summer sausage. I have a class. What is it called? Clawson. I'm not sure if that's what it is. Uh, but dill pickle half and I have an ounce of pepper jack cheese so I'm going to go ahead and eat this for my first meal for today and I will check in with you guys in a bit okay guys hope you don't think I'm horrible for this but I have celery in my refrigerator and I don't want it to go bad and I like celery so I'm going to have some celery with some natural peanut butter that's two stalks of celery so that's what I'm going to eat right now so I'll see you guys in a bit Okay, guys, checking in for my big meal for the day, last meal for the day. Have another huge salad, almost done with it. And once I get done with this, I'm going to switch over just to green beans. And I'm going to switch over to broccoli. I'm just going to change it up a little bit. So, in case you're wondering, spring mix, cucumber, uh, grape tomatoes, an avocado, olive oil, salt, pepper, and pink Himalayan seasoning mix. And then I have some kielbasa. This has been split into halves and fried in a cast iron. And yes, we do that intentionally with the darkness because that's how we like our sausage. That is going to do it for me today, guys. So I will see you later. Take care. Bye. Hey, guys. Checking in. First meal for today. Thought I'd show you. I have two ounces of summer sausage, an ounce of pepper jack cheese, and one Clawson dill pickle. Sorry, shaky. And I'm also going to have a serving of these vinaigrette pork rinds that I got from Walmart. They're pretty good. They're a little bit on the sour side, but it's all right. I'm going to go ahead and eat this, and I'll check in with you guys later. Bye. I forgot to actually record my dinner, but I did take pictures that I put up on Instagram. So I'll go ahead and show you guys what I had for dinner. And then with that, I'm going to end this days of eating i think there's about three or four days of eating here just to show you what i've been eating over the past week so i'll see you guys later take care bye